So, this is what it looks like in the morning. We have a reading test, and then there's a general test, and then there's a communication in English only, and your attendance. You must attend 80% of the classes. If you are late, you are absent. The classes start at 9. Travel culture, and the travel and culture program allows people to um, have an optional Friday. Monday through Friday, there's certificate English, and then there's certificate English at these hours. And you should check the list every week. There's a 10-week cycle, and so a book, you might start here in your book, and then after two weeks, you move to the next book, and then you come finish those five units, and then you return to your book B. So in 10 weeks, you cover the two programs. There's a wonderful person named Leslie. He's the academics, and the services are with Barbara, so you know who to talk with. Remember, English only in our school, and you, this is very respectful of other people. Remember, if people have a different culture or other ideas or a different religion or politics, we should be respectful of those things. Remember to stay safe, have fun, and learn with us. We have an open door policy. You don't need an appointment to talk. If you have a problem, say, help me, help me. And 11.15, it's time for the next thing to do. These are the goals of this class. We are asking, how will you use English in 2014? Like, I want to own a house. Or, what do you need to learn this week to prepare for the future? I want to learn the parts of a house. That will be good. Why are you wearing different shoes? See? Two different colors. Yeah. Why do you have different shoes? Those are two different ways. You have to say, look out, be careful. Your laces are not tied. You should tie your laces. You should tie your laces. Okay, so let's show that. So when you see something like this, you say, ah, look out, look out. Satori, go. Sato, go. Read. Look out. Be careful. Laces. Tied. See, you say, your laces are not tied. Thank you. Your shoes don't match. And then people want to know, how many bags can I carry? How much baggage can I carry? So we have how much and how many. How much luggage can I carry? How much water can I carry? How many bottles of water can I carry? And remember about good things to say, you say, Chimbetsi Mara, this should be an R. Chimbetsimara. Chimbetsimara means don't spit your saliva on me. And U.S. people, we say bless you or gesundheit. And gesundheit means health. It's similar to Fahrenheit. And let's see. We want to be very impolite. The opposite is polite, rude, or impolite. And we want to do the parts. What are the different parts of a tree? Branch, leaf, roots, trunk, and then so this is the canopy of the tree. What are the parts of the body? Well, look for another video about that. Thank you very much. <laughs>